Yo, 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 you pieces of trash. It's your boy, Malik Joe, and this is the Why Am I Like This Fast class. <clears throat> Might need some fucking water. Uh, fucking A, it's uh, April, what? Where's my fucking thing here? It's fucking, uh, all the fucking things covering the date. Ah, it's fucking, uh, give me a second here. I don't know what the fuck day it is. I'm sorry. It's April 11th, Tuesday. It's 10 o'clock p.m., so by the time you'll be hearing this shit, it's going to be Wednesday. Or unless if you really like me, you fucking watch it tonight. I know nobody watches these things anyway, but, you know, I got to start sticking with shit, you know. I'm like, I start doing some shit, and I, like, get, like, okay, this could be something, and then I stop doing some shit. So I'm going to fucking stick with it. All right? <clears throat> trying to give you quality information about shit that's going on around this son of a bitch. And by the way, none of this shit is, like, you know, informative at all. I suck at this. <laughs> I'm just doing it the fucking doing it. Meanwhile, the fucking Phillies were getting the shit smacked out of us by the fucking Mets. It's like 12 to 2. Yeah, that's fucking going on. Um, But good win Uh, two nights ago, which was great. Or was it three nights ago? Whatever the fuck it was. Cameron Rupp hits that home run. Send the boys home. Take that W on home for on home turf, which is good. Right now we're gonna ask Cape no home turf, but uh, hopefully I'm looking for a good year out of you guys. You know, I'm gonna try to catch up on some more baseball as well as the Flyers. Um, I don't know what's going on with the Flyers. I should probably check out what's going on with those motherfucks. Uh, actually, I'll do that in a second after I talk about the draft being in Philadelphia, which is a fucking mother, cause uh, there's traffic like a mother now. <laughs> a fucking mother and a mother. I don't know. There's fucking shit tons of traffic. They're fucking building new things to make sure. Oh yeah, let's make sure the city looks nice for these uh these soon to be NFL stars. But uh, after that, you know, you, we can go back to a shithole. You know, whatever. <laughs> it's like yeah, do all this nice shit for them to come. You know, build the fucking bridge. Build it. They're like building all this shit, and it's like yo. I don't know if you heard about the crisis in Philadelphia schools, but uh, it's fucking horrible. It's like, it's, it's just bad, and it should be focused more on that shit. Um, anyway, <laughs> um, starting to get fucking nice out. It's actually fucking hot today. Fuck being nice out. It was nice out the day before last. Today it was fucking 84 degrees, and it, it, you know, it brings that, you know, that reminder in your head, like, fuck it gets hot as shit here. Like, it gets so fucking hot. And, you know, sooner or later, that fucking AC is going to be pumping. That electric bill is going right to the fucking roof. Um, fucking hey, man. It was, it, was, it, was, it was okay, though, you know. But as soon as it gets hot, you know, bodies start to drop. And that's never good, you know, especially growing up in the hood. Uh, I don't live there anymore, but growing up in the hood, as soon as it got nice, it's just like, why, you know, it's like, oh, it's nice, Let's, let me go stand outside. It's like, why, you know something's gonna fucking happen, like, why did, Why even do it? You know something's gonna fucking happen. There's no point of you even going outside if you have no business out there, you know? I used to just, like, I, I don't even know how I made it this long, because I used to just, I never sold a drug, you know? I was just out there, because it was nice. All my friends, like, did you know, my friends got into, like, crazy shit, like, killing people and all that goofy shit. And I would just be out there, like, hey, it's me. <laughs> and uh, lucky enough, you know, nothing crazy happened to me, and I still have my motherfucking life. So, hey, yo, 25 now. <laughs> That's awesome. I know I haven't been keeping up on the fast cast. I'm going to try to bring one every Tuesday. I know I say something different every time. Fucking bear with me, all right? I'm human, and I'm trying to, you know, live a life as well. Not really, but, you know, I don't do shit. I'm lying. Who am I fucking kidding? I come home. I go to the fucking gym. I do the fucking gym. I drink a fucking ice-cold fucking beer. I might watch a little fucking wrestling or whatever's on TV. Try to catch up on a sport. Uh, I can't fucking watch the Phillies game right now, though. I don't know why I'm not. I, it's not picking up on my fucking TV. But whatever. Um... I'm trying to catch a Flyers game or something. Uh, fucking I. <sighs> Sorry about that, people. Uh, fuck, I'm, my body's beat up. Um, I returned back to the gym on Monday. 
after like did a house workout Thursday and I took three days off and fucking Monday kicked my ass, man. I fucking did squats. I'm fucking, I'm going to fill this shit tomorrow at work and I'll walk around all day at work and it's just going to be a fucking pain in the ass. And, um, like my body's changed so much since I've been like, you know, working out and not like since I've stopped like professionally boxing, my fucking thighs are fucking giant and they fucking rub together and it's the fucking most uncomfortable feeling ever. Like, I literally have to buy compression shorts. I can only wear compression shorts. I really, I physically believe that. Because you, the, if the, the, the thigh length on the underwear is not long enough, they just ride up. And just like, because like the curve on my thigh, it just rides on up, which is, this is weird to talk about. You know, pause if you're a dude, we're listening to this, but that's just the fucking most annoying shit ever. And you just find myself at work adjusting every five minutes. <laughs> I have, like, a couple pairs of, like, compression shorts that I wear, but this shit is, oh, my God, it's the fucking worst. Um, i definitely got to invest in some longer underwear or some compression fucking shorts. I'm not trying to pay $25 a fucking short, though, you know, like, just for our fucking underwear. Um, speaking of the fucking draft, hold on, I don't even know the fuck comes out of the draft ever. Not one year have I ever known, really, except... The uh, only year I've known people coming out of the draft that was going to be good was, like, Vince Young and Reggie Bush. Other than that, nobody gave a fuck. I mean, well, I don't, I don't give a fuck, you know. I just never, you know. There's too many fucking college teams. I can't keep the fuck up. You know, rankings are fucking weird. You know, you can lose to, like, an unranked team and only move down four ranks. Or you can beat the number one team and you're not the fucking number one team, you know. I don't fucking know how it works. It's fucking, I guess it's the same thing as boxing, though. You don't just jump up because you... I don't fucking know. I don't fucking know. It's fucking retarded. How about that? Now, if you're offended by that word, fuck you too. Um, <laughs> uh, fucking Easter's this Sunday. I got a motherfucking question. Why the fuck is Easter never on the same fucking weekend? Every time you look up, Easter is in a different fucking spot. I don't fucking get it. It's like Easter's the fuck on shuffle... And the rest of the fucking calendar is the same. It's like the fucking churches get together like, oh, man, last year, man, it was cold as shit on Easter. I'm not doing that shit again. I got this crazy all-white linen lay I'm trying to rock. We're going to have to push Easter back another couple of weeks. It's like, yo, one time Easter used to be in March. Sometimes that shit in April. Like, when the fuck? That shit, just do what the fuck you want to do. Like, the fuck? <laughs> Pastor, like, I got this drop top, and uh, it ain't gonna work out. Easter can't come in March this year. We're gonna push that bitch back to May. <laughs> like, I don't fucking get Easter. I really don't. Um, I mean, I get, nah, but I don't even want to get into that. But I just don't get it. Sorry, I heard of something about a moon or some shit. I don't fucking know. I don't know anything. I don't even know why the fuck. If you're listening to this, you're a fucking asshole. Why, why are you doing it? Why don't do it to yourself, you know? Just, just, just fucking, just go down and fucking click something else, you know? <laughs> no, I'm just joking. Fucking listen, subscribe, fucking like, dislike, I don't give a shit, I don't care. Nobody cares. Um, uh, me and a lady went to a fucking, uh, to this fucking spot called Ocean Prime. I've never been inside, but it's like, you know, like one of those good spots, like Del Frisco's, like one of those double-edged eagle steak night, whatever, fuck, you know what I'm trying to say, double steak eating mother you know what the fuck i'm trying to say that's a nice fucking spot all right and um yeah yeah yeah. we fucking went and uh it was really fucking nice inside the manager was really cool i met him he was good we we're talking about beer he's uh he was everything was great man um yeah the fucking oysters i had fucking oysters for the first time in my life uh i had the fucking sauerkraut oh was it no the horseradish <laughs> With the fucking cocktail sauce. It was just like, it, it was weird to eat. I mean, like, you don't chew it. You just, like, slurp it down, paws. Um, so it was, like, basically like eating egg yolk. I mean, it was just like you crack the egg open, you know, a very expensive egg yolk. <laughs> I mean, why is it so expensive? Is it, like, good for you? Is it, like, super nutrition? Or is it just, like, the, I guess it's where you are? Fuck it. Speaking of it, we're sitting at the bar, and, like, there's, like, I'm talking bottles on top, but they have, like, shit tons of liquor. 
there. I mean, obviously every bar has shit tons of liquor, but it's just not on display. Usually people have their, like, backup liquor. Like, in the back or in the basement, whatever the fuck they want to put their liquor. This fucking liquor was stacked up so fucking high, like, you had to be shack on top of shack to get some of their backup fucking bottles. Yeah, I know, where's the fucking ladder, but holy shit. That shit was so fucking high. Like, why? Anyway, fuck that thing. Um... But it was fun, though. It was great. I saw some old friends. It was great. Everything was great. Um, what else was going on? Fucking attacks on Syria. It's like, yeah. That, I mean, I read a little bit about it. Don't get me. I'm not no expert. I don't really, you know. I don't really tether myself to this world or anything in it. I'm just here, you know, going along for the ride. Um, but, uh, yeah. From what I read, it's basically Syria attacking Syria, so we attack Syria to tell Syria not to attack Syria. <laughs> I mean, that's from what I got from it. Whatever, I might be wrong. I'm a totally nitwit when it comes to shit like this. I don't really give a fuck. Whatever. Um, but yeah, uh, that shit's happening. Uh, hopefully, nothing crazy will happen. Or if it does, well, we're just gonna have to roll with those fucking punches, aren't we? Uh. <laughs> uh uh, fucking looking into this Dennis thing, man. I'm trying to get my fucking teeth together. I mean, my I'm, it's fine. It's just like I got one cracked tooth. Like, it's like chipped, and I just want to get a crown on it. But the fucking dentist is so expensive. It's like, dude, why is the dentist 500 fucking bucks? Somebody tell me. Send it to me on my DM. Send it to me on direct message some type of way. on DM and direct message, same fucking thing, whatever. You know what I'm saying? Um, and, uh, yeah, we're going to wrap this up. This has been the Millie Joe Fastcast for uh, April 11th, Tuesday. By the time you're hearing this, it's probably Wednesday. I said that already. Uh, and fuck you guys, I'm leaving. <laughs>